Yeah, you pass for your space where you guess now. She guys with the public apology. Guys, you know the funniest things about Ileba you winning head of house yesterday is why other people we are concerned that they are going to be up for possible eviction and some people are seriously concerned with the way the head of house challenge game went. Adekunle was very much concerned that Ileba Yena has authority and power to gather them without stress to start doing apology that this time around she might do 10 apology. Then Pere who was confused wanted to find out more about about what Adekunle was talking about. Look at what Cross and Adekunle told Perry. Let me ask you a like, do you think there's anything that you're doing wrong? It's just, it's just the fucking universe, man. You know, everything this up as is over. So that was Adekunle's explanation on what he was talking about. Like he was seriously concerned about some of the things that would be going on outside house, how the people would be dragging Pere after his military experience and everything. It was Ilebaye that won the head of house challenge game. And guys, to add sort on injury, you know that these housemates they already made up their mind that they were not going to attend to any apology session that Ilebaye will hold. But now that Ilebaye has become the head of house she will easily have their attentions and do apology anytime she likes and i'm like so people are concerned that they will be going home on sunday or people are concerned they will be up for possible eviction you are here you are thinking about what is going on outside and who is doing apology and who is not doing apology thank god he said the universe is doing its thing and everything they sub the way it's supposed to sub Guys, not be smart in no cross cried foul yesterday because his plans, strategy and everything he wanted to happen during the final did not just actualize. Remember that he had a conversation with Angel where he said that he wanted the first year your eye has made to be in the final and he does not want either Messi AK, CC, Ilebaye to join them to the final that if it is another person that they have the greater chances of winning the show. In fact, he was specific that he might be winning the show. So seeing how everything plays out yesterday that most of the people that he does not want to see in the final, that is Ileba Yesisi and Messi AK, we are already in the final. Guys, he really lost hope as he cries out that he does not think that he will be winning the show again, that he just wastes his money buying immunity to the final. But anyways, that he being in the final is a great opportunity. But for him to win the show, he does not even see any chances of him winning the show coupling with the fact that cc was seriously on his neck yesterday dragging him calling him all sort of name cursing him out telling him that that even though she is not going to win this show or even though she might not win this show that she does not want a situation whereby cross will still be in that house while she will be evicted that she wants cross to leave the house before her that was why she decided to make sure that she did not put miss ak up for possible eviction that cross has luck if not that he has immunity that the way he would have chopped nomination no be smart you know that he would have chopped nomination back to back to back to back and he would have left in week nine i'm not be smart you know cc was seriously angry as she said that her annoyance is that she has never put up cross for possible eviction that hearing that cross put her up for possible eviction really broke her heart because cross have never shown loyalty to her that she has shown all loyalty to cross that when she was upstairs she was making sure that she came from upstairs to downstairs even though they have food upstairs to eat that she would just come downstairs and cook for cross make sure that cross is okay that all cross could pay her with is to pay her with nomination that she is causing cross because according to her she said that it is cross that she feels that if she did not win the show let cross be the one to win it because for her she feels that cross is genuine cross has good mind cross cannot even hurt a fly that everything he does he does it spontaneously that he does not even think or premeditate anything before doing it guys she was just saying all of that me i was just like they play you think everybody in that house did not come with a strategy do you think that everybody that is there up to now did not come with a serious strategy and they still make it up to week nine for anybody to be in that house till week nine everybody came with a serious plan and strategy that will sustain them to the final and possibly win the show and i was even thinking why is it that whenever cc feels that someone has wronged her the person is now bad person the person is this one the person is that one guys it is a game they went into that house to play so nomination is part of it in fact she was even saying that she is not a nice person that whenever she does anything nice for somebody that she always
always expects them to reciprocate it back because she would have chosen to do bad to those people. And I'm like, they play. They play, madam. In fact, Pera went ahead to tell Cross, including Venita, that he shouldn't bother himself about anything, that he should just free his mind. In fact, when CC was just asking Pere, if you were the one that Cross nominated, will you not feel bad? And Pere told her that, see, nomination is the part of the game, that he will not just feel bad if anybody in the house nominates him because, according to him, it is part of the game. In fact, Venita as well confirmed to Cross that, see, you shouldn't feel bad about anything it is part of the game and guys later on we now saw cc and cross having a conversation trying to resolve their differences in fact they had a very lengthy conversation even though at some point cc was not just buying any of the things that cross was just telling her at that particular point in time but from the look of things their friendship is actually coming back to stay again guys another interesting thing that happened yesterday was when cross nominated angel during nomination process guys i was so so shocked and surprised because for him he said that he feels that angel do not want him to be in the final as angel never wanted him to get the immunity um, when i heard that i was just like wow woo. like guys after all their plan guys honestly speaking i think that angel wouldn't have nominated cross for whatsoever reason for whatsoever reason then seeing cross nominating angel at the final nomination of the season guys it really shocked me and surprised me because i never even saw that one coming lastly before I even call it a wrap guys the way soma was seriously pacifying angel telling angel that she shouldn't worry because angel was seriously crying and down she was very very emotional because she didn't win that head oh game and it really broke her down because according to her she was telling Soma that all she has ever done in her life is to fight and fight and fight without getting the actual result guys you know it is all just because of the head of her challenge game that she lost out yesterday even though she put in all her best and her 100 remember i know how important that winning would have been to her but it is also important to elebaye that was why she decided to hang on and make sure she win that challenge even though she as well was feeling very very hot and tired she decided to hang on to make sure she win the challenge guys after everything that angel told suma yesterday what they did they actually prayed very hard suma gave angel shoulder to lean on and shoulder to cry on as he was just there pacifying her making sure that she is all right guys what do you all think about all the things we've talked about so far let me know your thoughts in the comment section subscribe my channel please